Hi, beautiful people. Hey. It's your girl, Just Got Talent. How you are oh, doing? Sorry. Hope you are doing great. Mm. Welcome back to my Joyce. channel, my wonderful subscribers, my immediate my family guy. Thanks for joining my channel. Thanks for loving comment on my videos. I really appreciate all your comments. Hey. Guys, you know that your comments will give me joy. Keep commenting on my videos and I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Happy Sunday to you all. I, I hope you all have a good time. Okay, today's video is all about another method of making a okra yeah you know guys I, I told you guys on my last video i love okra okra is one of my best soup and i like to try different methods how to make uh, okra you just discover something very interesting i used to make okra with a uh, fried and uh, with uh, sorry with uh, fried fresh tomatoes but this time around i'm gonna try uh, this okra uh, with uh, puree yeah tomato puree as you can all see look at it and then um, these are the all the uh, the item we're gonna use for the okra so we have the okra here we have the, the grain i just boiled the grain we had the camera this is the grain and i have uh, oil i have some uh, fried uh, uh, shake you guys know that i love fresh shake in my soup, I love it. I just love fried shake. It tastes better than uh, just a, a boiled one. Yes, I also have some uh, a fried beef. Yeah, I have some fried fried beef, and I have some uh, uh, prawns and uh, uh, crayfish. I have some sliced uh, onions. I have some uh, uh, pepper and uh, the, the spices here. I have really uh, nice spices. I have some. Uh, uh, Curry, I have some fried garlic, I have some uh, 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 thyme, and I have some muscat, and I also have some uh, black pepper, and I have a uh, uh, fried onion, guys. Yes, guys, these are the old items I'm gonna use for the soup, and I have some uh, Maggie cubes. Okay, so stay tuned, guys. I'll be back. I'm back, guys. I have put the, the tomato puree here the camera and I allow it to boil for five minutes. Look at it. It has boiled very well. Look at it. This soup is very easy and very fast. So we're gonna start by putting the fried fried beef inside. Yeah, fried beef inside. Then we'll put the, the fried shaki inside because you know Uncle don't have time to get done. So we don't want our uncle to be Done. When okra is too done, you're not enjoying. So now we put the the the, the straight shrimps and the uh, and the shrimps and onion and the pepper and the uh, crayfish inside. Yes, guys. Okay, this soup is very easy. Don't try this method. Try it, and we we'll put the spices inside. Look at the spices; they are all going inside. Yes, guys. Okay. So we are, uh, give it a stir. Yes, guys. This soup is not gonna be there. Uh, so, uh, uh, liquid, okay? We're gonna have it a uh, uh, little bit thick, you know? It's gonna be uh, looking now. Uh, a very uh, rich, a rich soup, okay? Yeah, look at it. It's looking really nice and ready. So, we are about to boil a little bit, maybe like uh, uh, five, another five minutes. Okay, another five minutes. Yeah, guys. Another five minutes before we can put the remaining uh, the, the uh, uh, okra and the the uh, grain. Okay, I'll be back, guys. I'm back, guys. Look at this soup. Wow. So the soup has went very well. You got it. You got it. Wow. Looking good already. So now we we'll put the, the okra inside. Queen of December. The okra inside. She's so pretty. Then we have the the green inside. And always at the only before. Maybe five minutes. Yeah. Five minutes. Then it's ready. This okra soup is very uh easy to prepare and it looks delicious a 
of course is really delicious. It don't just look it's not looking delicious only, but it's really uh, delicious. Look at it. Tomatoes puree and with grain, yes. I love vegetables, you know. Sometimes I like to make okra, simple okra, but with vegetable it makes more sense. Yeah. It makes more sense with vegetable. Look at it. Wow. All the delicacy I have. This is really rich. cover it again because the okra is already inside when you are cooking okra once you put your okra no more covering the, the, the soup yeah you don't need to cover it you just leave it open allow it to boil very well you have two minutes then the okra will be ready okay wow That is it guys, this is the outcome of my delicious okra soup. If you like this method or you'll be trying this method, let me know on the comment section, okay? I am loving it, the smell is really good and the taste is also good, okay? If it makes sense to you, 
give it a thumbs up and leave your comment if you're just passing by you like my video subscribe to my channel for more of my interesting videos okay bye bye see you guys on my next video bye ciao